six selected figure that will replace question mark in the following figure series. You have four figures and you have four options. The four answers V and C is in the top position and in the question figures V and C is in the top position. So we can find out the answer using V and C position. Here in the first figure V is in left position. In the second figure V changed its position to right. So V moved. Again in the third figure V is in right position but it rotated 90 degree anti-clockwise. That is from second to third we rotated 90 degree anti-clockwise. So 90 degree rotation in the third figure. In the fourth figure we changed its position. That is we moved from right to left. That means in the fifth figure we will rotate 90 degree anti-clockwise. So in the fourth figure we is like this. That means in the fifth figure we will rotate 90 degree anti-clockwise. So we will become like inverted. So we will be V symbol like this, inverted symbol. So we will be like this. Again if you look at C, C in the first figure is in right, then in the next, second figure it moved to left. Then in the third figure it rotated 90 degree anti-clockwise. That is from second to third it rotated 90 degree anti-clockwise. Again in the fourth figure it shifted its position from left to right. That means in the fourth, fifth figure it will rotate 90 degree anti-clockwise. So rotate 90 degree anti-clockwise. That means in the fourth figure C is like this and then rotate 90 degree anti-clockwise means C will be upward. So if you look at V and C, V downward and C upward, V downward and C upward, option 4 is your answer. And if you want to check out the other three symbols, lower symbols, you can see in the first figure to second, they interchanged their position. That is D comes in the place of arrow, arrow comes in the place of the symbol, the symbol place comes in the place of D. So, they rotated and interchanged their they interchanged their position. In the second figure to third figure, you can see the middle symbol 180 degree rotated and T rotated 90 degree clockwise and arrow rotated 90 degree clockwise. Again, from third to fourth figure, they interchanged their position. Again, in the fourth to fifth figure, arrow will rotate 180 degree clockwise and this one will rotate 90 degree clockwise and T will rotate 90 degree clockwise. That means downward arrow rotated 180 degree means it will upward and this one 90 degree rotated clockwise means this will be like this and T 90 degree from this to 90 degree rotated clockwise means T will be downward. So, option 4 is your answer.